fold so easily on something like that. Like, they're just being fucking pussies, pretty much. But, whatever. We'll just pretend like it didn't happen, I guess. Um... It's not like they ruined the game or anything by doing it. I mean, the dungeon's exactly the same and all that. But... Yeah, so if you play this Song of Time right here, this block on top of this ledge will pop back down. Okay. And you can go up here. And this isn't necessary or anything, but I'm just showing you how to do it and what's up here. Now, yeah, you have to use your shield to uh, block these things. Okay, so, this is a like-like. These things are fucking annoying. Even in the original, you want to avoid these, because these... If you let them suck you in, and they will move towards you, um, they will, uh, yeah, it only takes two arrows and you can kill them. You can use your sword, but if you get too close to them, they'll suck you in, and, uh, if you don't kill them right away, they'll actually eat your, uh, huh, I did a backflip into it, that's awesome. Uh, they'll actually eat your tunic and your shield, just like in every other game that they're in. Um, so, if you do, if they do eat them, or they take them away from you, um, you can kill them, like, if you kill them right away, you can, uh, get them back, it'll spit it back out, but if you wait too long to kill them after they take it from you, they're fucking gone, so you'd basically have to go back and re you know, you'd have to buy your tunic and your shield again from a shop, which is fucking expensive as shit, so... I recommend, if nothing else, use the arrows or just take off your tunic or something like that um, whenever you're fighting them. Whatever you gotta do, don't lose it, is what I'm saying. So, uh, yeah. Um. So, yeah, anyway. Oh, shit. I'm sucking ass now. Already lost three hearts from these bitches. All right, so oh, there's three hearts over there. How convenient. All right, so you can use your oh shit, quick shot. <clears throat> and uh, climb up on this. Oops. Quit moving around, you fucking dickhead. Ha! Done that one time. Alright. Alright, so it's very important that you go out on that side that, so you can push that block down towards the middle. Um, oops. What an idiot I was there. Bad example, sorry. Alright. <clears throat> But yeah, Wind Waker. <laughs> the other rant that I have, uh, somebody, actually, um, a friend of a friend of mine's, not my friend, but yeah, uh, he, we got into, I wouldn't say an argument, but he said something that was just kind of hilarious to me, and I gave him a bunch of shit about it, and my, my friend, he, uh, was laughing because he agreed with me, you know, and it just seemed preposterous. He, we were talking about uh, Legend of Zelda games because we're dorks, I guess. I don't know. Like, I, I think it's funny that we just happen to all have played Legend of Zelda and like the series. I mean, most people do who have played them, but you know, it's he. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember how it came up exactly, but he was like, yeah, the best, I, he, he thought the best, the best Legend of Zelda in, out of all the series, er, uh, sorry, I was looking at my 
scan progress from my antivirus. Anyway, he, was, he thought the best Zelda out of the whole series was Wind Waker, and I was like, really? Really? Wind Waker? Really? That's the best you got? That's that's your favorite? I mean, I'm not... Alright, like, let me put it to you this way. If you guys like Wind Waker, that's cool. I mean, it's not a bad game. I'll say that. It's definitely not a bad game at all. However, when you compare it to all the other ones, like this game, or, hell, even the original, or A Link to the Past, or whatever, or Link's Awakening, I don't remember, or even Twilight Princess. I wouldn't even say that one was the best one. Like, I mean, it, it's definitely comparable to this game, but, uh, I don't know. As far as Wind Waker being the best game in the series, I just don't, I don't know. I, I can't agree with that. Oh, shit. I mean, first of all, the graphics suck. And say what you want about it, they just, you know, I mean, it's a kid's game. It, it looks, it sounds, and feels like a kid's game all the way through. That, that aside, we can talk about the gameplay. I mean, uh, you know, uh, I don't know. I, maybe I'm getting into a silly rant. Like, I could just sit here and talk for a whole ten minutes and do a review of the game and give ex ex excuse me, explanations as to why I feel that it's not the best game or even a really great Zelda game, but, you know, everyone's got their own opinion, you know. Oh shit. Uh, like I said, I've played it a fair share of times because I have it, you know, I bought it when it came out. I, I give every Zelda game that I buy or play or whatever a chance, you know, and there really isn't too many that I've played that I didn't, uh, that I completely disliked, so, I mean, but that one, it was probably out of all of them the biggest disappointment for me, and, you know, it's just, uh, you, you know, you spend 80% of your time just going across this fake looking ocean. I mean, it looks like it was cartoon animated. I mean, it, the whole thing is... The whole thing looks silly in the... Um, I guess Nintendo's reasoning for actually doing that was so that they can focus on, uh, you know, actual, like, facial animations and that kind of stuff, making it look more realistic. Oh shit, I'm gonna fucking... Hang on a second. Oh, it's fucking Lee. Hang on. Oh, let's be like... Doing a... Okay. All right. So let me think here. Is there anything else we can do while we're down here? I think so. I think there's one more room that we missed over here. Let's go check it out. Um. Fuck. Oh my god. Really? That really just fucked that up. <laughs> yep. I'll talk to him while... Oh shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Hmm. So, anyway... Oh, there's a key. So it's got to be in here somewhere. Okay. So... Gotta watch out for these fucking things. 
So just come over here towards this area and, and open up this door. Alright, so you can come over here, but watch your step watch your step, obviously. So you, if you fall down, you're gonna have to start all the way back to uh, that one room below. <laughs> um so anyway, there's actually uh if you hit that switch up there on the wall, that door will open for a limited amount of time and you can get the uh, dungeon map, but uh, I'm not going to get it because I don't need it, so I'm just going to keep going. Oh, 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 okay, so be careful here, as soon as you jump on this, you're going to get chased by flames, so don't dawdle. Alright, so let's keep going. Oh, really, motherfucker? Okay, yeah. I like how the flames help push me along. <laughs> oh my god, okay. So, you just get that, and there's the dungeon map over there, as I'm sure you can see. In that cage. Alright, so then you stumble across here. Very important not to jump off, or you'll have to go back through that shit again. Not that it's a big deal, but I know you're gonna want to set a bomb right here. Shut up, bitch! And then you just come over to this side and just crawl over. And you'll be on the ladder. Huh. Here and hit the switch. Alright, I'm gonna talk to this guy. That's all he has to say. He's useless. Alright, so, this key, and then go back the way you came, because the next Gorn is up here as well. I don't know. I would say, Wind Waker is a decent game for sure. It's got all the Zelda elements in it to make it a Zelda game. Really? <laughs> Fucking really? Wow, okay. That is fucking stupid. Alright, so anyway, back to what I was saying before I was rudely thrown back the fuck off. Um. Fuck you, little bitch! Um. Alright, I'm going to have to jump across here. I recommend doing it this way. But, you can do it however you want. As long as it works. Hit the switch. Nope. And then make your way over there. Um. One Waker's got all the stuff that a regular Zelda game, you know, should, should or would have. But, uh... Like I said, I mean, you just spend so much time on the water, it just... I'm, I mean, I give them credit for trying to do something different and, you know, make it feel fresh, but Jesus Christ, it was so boring. And then you have to spend a whole bunch of money deciphering shit, and oh my god. Just fucking... There's only, like, five dungeons in that game, too. It's really stupid. So then just make your way back over across these platforms and uh... 
motherfucker don't even try. Kill you! Alright, then, yeah. Jump up here like so. And keep going. Alright, now oh, this is the badass awesome room that everybody loves, I'm sure. So you just walk through here. However, watch out for these motherfuckers. Yeah, if you don't go through the correct path, you will get burned. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Watch out for that shit, too. Oh my god. Yeah. Can't even take my own advice. Forgot how far out it goes. Oh shit, yeah, it's definitely a trap. It's a trap! Okay, so I'm gonna come over here, open this door. I see one in here, but you can't get to it yet, so don't even try, or don't worry about it. <clears throat> Hard on me. Hang on a second. Okay, just check it and see how much. Ugh, fuck. Recording time I had left. I still got plenty. God damn it! Fucking tried to lock on it too. Fuck you. Yeah, you see what happens? You see what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass? That's what happens. Alright, so, you gotta hit the switch. The only way, the only path to get is right here. Or, go back. And then go. Jump up like so. Alright, so, before you break all these jars, you see this door, it looks a little bit different. You might not be able to tell right away, but it is different. If you hit it with the sword, yeah, or try to open it. Yeah, so back away if you ever see that happen. Oh shit. Oh, unlike what I just did. But anyway. Yeah, enough about this. So these fake doors, you gotta blow them up with a bomb. It's a fucking death trap, pretty much. Alright, and you got more bombs over here. You need, you absolutely must have bombs in this next area, so don't bother coming in here unless you have a fair amount of bombs. You will need them. Okay, so this guy. <laughs> oh, excuse me, throw bombs at him. And then hit the fucking... And then after you hit him a few times or whatever, we'll go back in. Rinse and repeat. Oh, suck it, buddy. No, he's not liking that at all. Oh, and he's dead. Like that. Now, let's head up here and let it take you away. Alright. Oh. See the switch.